So um, this is trailer restoration video part two. Again, this is my aristocrat 1975, no, 1964 lowliner. And in part one, I had started the demolition. And now in part two, the demolition is complete. So as you can see, I removed everything inside. It's all gone down to the bare floor, cabinets removed, everything else. And I've actually started to rebuild. So I'm starting with this front uh, piece here. Here's the old one right here. You can see how rotted out and bad it is. And I put a nice new one in. I also cut out a rotted part of the floor. I'm going to try and save the floor as much as I can and then I'm just gonna put these two sheets of quarter inch plywood over it to strengthen it a little bit and make it look a little nicer I still have to deal with all of this rot back here but I'm gonna rebuild all this uh, ironically it's harder tearing it apart than it is building it I mean I'm I can't stress enough it's not all that hard uh, it's just some basic wood, screws, staples, etc., wires, and it's really not that difficult. So I'm starting to get confidence after I finish this piece here. And that, by the way, that little oscillating tool, get one of those. I mean, really, get one. It's the most amazing tool ever, and it's been vital to this whole process. I got it at Harbor Freight for $16, I think, real cheap. I also think I'm going to try and save most of this front, actually. It's in very good shape. Maybe the bottom could use replacing, but that's about it. And um, all the piping is good. All the electrical is still in decent shape. So, again, I'm going to try and save a lot. Uh, the roof skin is in really good shape. No holes, nothing. Uh, I'm going to pressure wash it down and have it repainted clean it off, put it back up. There's all the other skin back there that came off the other side. Let me give you a quick look at that back here. So there's the other side of it. And again, not bad except for the bottoms where the water got in. You can see down here, real bad. And then way over here, this is, this is really bad. All this has to be replaced. This is just in terrible shape um, but really if once you get new wood it's it's not all that bad it's not all that difficult because all this is gonna come out and uh, I think it's gonna go rather quickly now so in part three I'm hoping um, to have you know the flooring done most of the framing and walls done and insulated and start getting up the new paneling so uh, we'll check back then. Can't wait to see ya. Hope you're enjoying this and gives you a little inspiration. Again, let me remind you, I have no experience doing this at all. None. Zero. But it's, it's really fun. I'm actually having a really good time with it. So, see you next time.